hey guys it's c welcome back to my channel and welcome to another episode of vlogmas so i hope you all have been enjoying the last two videos which were um gift guides the first one was gift guides for the men in your life and the second one which was yesterday was um the gift guides for a toddler if you have toddlers um of your own or others that you have to buy for i did a gift guide for them so of course today i had to do the gift guide for her couldn't leave my ladies out and so fellas and other ladies who are looking to give the um women in your life some gifts i wanted to give you all some ideas um some great gifts inexpensive gifts um gifts i believe that the women in your life will love so I did write them down so that I wouldn't forget. Um, but we're going to go ahead and jump right in because, again, don't want this to be another long talking video. <laughs> um, so first thing I got for the woman in your life who loves to relax, I got a few things that are all things comfy, all things cozy. Number one is slippers. Um, if you watch my um, previous videos, you know that I love slippers and a good pair of good cozy soft comfy slippers are always a thing on my list like I, I buy them for myself i just love nice cozy slippers so that is number one number two to go along with that i put a robe um we all like to be nice and cozy when we get home to take off our clothes take a shower bath relax and then throw on that cozy robe um robes are good some people like um thin robes some people like thick robes um i'm a thin robe type of person um the comfy thick robes look so luxurious but i'm very hot nature so i would get hot in that really quick <laughs> so i'm more of a thin robe type person um but anybody in your life who loves robes go ahead and get her one along with those slippers so that she can be comfy and cozy when she gets home or when she just wants to relax go ahead and get that because i'm pretty sure she'll love it um number three i did a massager um and when i say massager i'm talking about like the back massager that you can like put in the chair or you can lay it in the bed that's the kind i'm talking about all these things i'm going to try to find good pictures and pop them on the screen um but yeah you all know that walmart has good things in their aisles of like gift ideas and stuff and normally they always have that massager that I'm talking about. It's one that you it's portable. You can take it wherever and you can put it in the seat or like like I said, lay it in the bed and it massages. And I think some of them heat heat up too. So those are always good, especially um for the women in your life who are um workers who sit at desk or who are content creators who sit and edit and all this stuff. Those would be good for them because I know sometimes my back is hurting or sometimes I just want to feel good while I'm editing or while I'm working because y'all know I'm a teacher so sometimes I have to be at my desk or I'm at a computer. A massager would be good and to go along with the massager I would say um, a foot massager. If you have the woman in your life who's on her feet a good foot massage is always <laughs> always on my list. Um, if, if they can't massage my feet, or if he's not here to massage my feet, a good foot massager is always good. And last year, um, we got Michael's child care provider for her Christmas gift. Well, part of her Christmas gift, we got her the foot massager. They have them at Walmart. I'm going to pop a picture. And I did see them this year, so they do still have them this year. It's where you can, um, turn it on and you can slide your feet in. It feels like slippers. Um, and you slide your feet in and it massages your feet. And that is a good gift. And it was inexpensive too. So, like I said, all these things, I'm trying to find inexpensive, um, gift ideas but that was that was a good gift and i want one for myself <laughs> so um check walmart like i said i'm gonna pop pictures on there but check walmart because they did have them when i went in there this year uh the next thing i would say would be a bath pillow um i love to take bubble baths to relax um to watch youtube on my ipad in the bathroom you know just to just just to mellow out and i love um a back pillow and they do have them on amazon i'm gonna link the one that i have um i need to get a new one because one of my straps popped on it but it's one that suctions to the tub and um you can lean back they have the full one and they have the one just for your back so the, those are always good for the woman who loves to take 
baths those bath pillows feel so good and and to go along with that i didn't put it on my list but i'll throw it in is a bath caddy i'll post mine up here um i love my bath caddy it's, it just goes around it's a wood one you can sit your drink like i have water you can put your wine you can put your ipad and then it has all little compartments on there that you can just sit stuff on while you're in the tub relaxing so a bath caddy is good too um so the next thing on my list i put candles <laughs> If you know that the woman in your life loves candles, go ahead and get her some. Pay attention to the ones that she has around the house, the smells that she loves. I wish I'd have put this up sooner because Bath and Body Works just had a candle sale. <laughs> um, so I wish I would have been able to do this video sooner so that I could have helped y'all out so that I can get some of those candles on sale. But y'all know I'm gonna link my um fall candles video. Y'all know that I shop inexpensive places, so there are other places besides Bath and Body Works who has nice candles so go to those places as well because candles are love i just ordered a candle yesterday like i needed another one like if your lady loves candles go ahead and get her some more because we can never have enough candles at the end of the day um the next thing i put on the list gift cards um we love to shop and we love to shop with money that is not ours <laughs> so gift cards are always a good option if you don't know like if any of these things on the list don't apply to the women in your life get them a gift card gift cards to any stores that they like um visa gift cards even gift cards to the spa um that was also on my list too uh an appointment at the spa to get a nice massage you know i mean foot um pedicure stuff anything at the spa get them a gift card for that that way they can make the appointment on their own time pick a day where they just want to relax have like a self-care day and just go to the um spa give them a gift card to the spa as well gift card you can never go wrong with a gift card you can't think of anything else you can never go wrong with a gift card we always love gift cards <laughs> um the next thing i put on the list again for the cozy comfy uh woman <laughs> i put throw blankets um if you've watched me for a little while you know that i love throw blankets i have throw blankets all over the house in just about every room on the couches in the linen closet uh on the blanket ladder <laughs> they're just everywhere but on my list i put throw blankets slash um heated blankets because a lot of people like those heated blankets on those times where it's cold and you want to just get extra comfy the heated blankets are good too they normally have those at walmart i've seen them at cvs other places i'm sure but the heated blankets are good too for the person who's always cold <laughs> um heated blankets nice and cozy but again throw blankets slash heated blankets are a good option as well um i also put money um slash cash out <laughs> y'all know me and my kids at school were talking today like i was like what y'all want for christmas and they was like cash out and i said my husband said the same thing i asked him i said babe what you want for christmas just cash out me i'm like but hey that's what they want so if the woman in your life loves money outside i meant to put this with gift cards but gift cards slash money slash cash out <laughs> even if she doesn't care about cute cards all that are cash just send her a cash app or zelle venmo all the other money transferring apps just send her some money um the next thing i put on my list was favorite things so if you pay attention to the woman in your life which you should um just get her some of her favorite things if you can't think of like good gifts or things um that you know are on this list that don't apply to her get some of her favorite things like her favorite snacks her favorite drinks um you know just some favorite things that you can put in the bag, some thoughtful things, I would say, like her favorite perfume, just favorite things that you can think of, things that you've seen her pick up from the store, or things that you see her constantly get or constantly talk about. Those are some of her favorite things that she may not think to get for herself or she would um, love for, for somebody else to give them. So I know, um, I think I said it before, um, sometimes for my husband, I get him like a bag with his favorite treats, like favorite chips, his favorite candy, his favorite snacks, his favorite drinks, those types of things. Get those for the women in your life. You know, I tell, I'm telling you, most women love thoughtful gifts. So if you gave a woman a gift that was all of her favorite things, she would love you forever because it shows that you're paying her attention. So favorite things. If you can't think of any of these other things, just some of the simplest things you probably wouldn't even think she would care about, she will give her some of my favorite things um the next thing i put was a trip or a getaway 
I'm the type of person where I love everything on this list, which is why I came up with it. But I also love a getaway, even if it's just for one night, even if it's not even, it could be in the same city, you know, just to get away from your norm, you know. So if your woman, you know, is always working or always doing things, take her somewhere. Take her somewhere nice, even if it's just for a night. Trust me, she'll love it. Um, you know, I, I, like I said, I want to keep these things inexpensive. Even if it's just for a night, just take her somewhere. Get her mind off of the things that she's normally responsible for. Just so she can relax, have a good time, enjoy you. You know, so a trip or a getaway is always a good option. You know, just plan it later, but a getaway is always something that's on my list. <laughs> um, like I said, it could be one night. It, just, it could be somewhere close, local, whatever. Just to get away from thinking about things I have to do at home. The last thing that I put on the list was um, do something nice. Um, if you all are into um, the five love languages, my number one love language is acts of service. And I believe it's because I'm always doing things um, for people. I'm always just constantly doing, constantly doing something always has to get done. And so if somebody does something for me that I, I have to do it that I feel like I'm responsible to do and they do it for me it means the world to me so if your woman in your life is like that if she's always doing for others and not really doing for herself or if she just takes on so much try to take a load off of her and do something that you know she you probably wouldn't even think she would care about but she did like babe I'm normally cooking or whatever if, if I come home and he's cooked a meal <laughs> like it's the best thing in the world for me or if I come home and he's ran my bath or, or he said oh, I want to give you massage just doing things that I don't have to do you know so if your woman is like that in your life and she just you know does so much just do a few little things tidy up the house for her take the kids you have kids take the kids out and give her a break you know wash the dishes or do just simple things that can lighten her load a little bit that would be a great Christmas gift I know it would be for me as well so um and also at the end of this, I meant to say at the beginning, I was going to do a gift guide slash what my wish list is. Um, <laughs> me and one of my friends um, were talking about wish lists and stuff like that. And um, and then my friend Tika, she just posted her video uh, <laughs> yesterday. And we were talking about her wish list and how crazy and expensive it was. And she tried to shame us on Facebook. But it, it was. <laughs> but I wanted to talk about what my wish list is as well because me and baby were talking about christmas and me and my kids at school were talking about christmas and all this stuff and so i wanted to include my wish list in case anybody just wanted to know or wanted to get other ideas to get somebody else as well um all of these things of course i would love but also i have um about four things on my wish list number one is a new phone um <laughs> it's definitely time for a great i do have the um iphone the x max um, but I do want a new phone, so that's number one, of course, iPhone. Um, number two, I want a new laptop and I want a MacBook. Um, I think I, I think I want a MacBook Air. I like the Pro, but I think I want an Air. Um, but any MacBook would be great and it would be better than what I'm using now <laughs> for my laptop. Um, the third thing on my list I put was softbox lights. Y'all know I'm new to YouTube and so I'm trying to um, get basically step up my game a little bit and so I want better lighting. Like right now I'm using natural lighting and the light in the living room but mostly natural lighting um, and I, I have ring lights but I want two softbox lights. Um, or some other type of lighting that I see other content creators using because it helps especially when those times when I can't record during the daylight and I need to record at night. I still want my quality to be good. So those two softbox lights are on my list um, of things that I, I would love for Christmas. So the last thing on my list, um, y'all know I love coffee. So I want an espresso maker. Me and my mama always talk. She's on the phone with me normally in the mornings when I'm... Um, getting coffee from Dunkin and Starbucks and sometimes I ask for an espresso shot when I'm tired so I want my own espresso maker and I did see one in Walmart recently so I want that so again phone macbook softbox lights and espresso maker so CT my list ain't that expensive <laughs> um but yeah so those are things on my wish list so my battery is blinking so that means I need to go ahead and hush so I'm going to go ahead and end this video but thank y'all for watching but leave in the comments some things that are on your wish list or some things that you are getting for the women in your life so you can get some other give people some other options of gifts to get let us all help each other out because I'm always looking for things to buy for somebody so 
Thanks again for watching, guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you come back tomorrow for another day of Vlogmas. But thank you all. I really appreciate y'all for rocking with me during this journey. But again, come back tomorrow for Vlogmas Day. What day is today? Come back tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 10. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.